Maestro's guest is a great guy. I mean it. I've, I've had the pleasure of knowing him for a few years, and you all got to know him as the Man of Steel in the series Lois and Clark. He's back now in a brand new series called Clubhouse. Take a look at a clip. I'll be honest, though. I'm starting to think that maybe I was slipping a little bit. I'm not getting younger, man. It's not your time, kid. Nah, I just I don't want to go out on top. You missed the best part of the ride. What's that? Pass it along what you know. Oh, yeah. Please welcome Dean Kane. Welcome to the show. Thank, Thank you so much for being you. here. How great is he, though? I mean, uh, come on. Yeah. Come on. Don't say that. One of the nicest guys I've ever known. Uh, here's the extra 10. That was perfect. <laughs> no. So, um, wait, wait, did I just uh, hear you on the radio this weekend? Yes. Because I was listening to the WFAN. Yes. I was at the Mets, uh, Mets Cub game. Uh huh. And the Mets, uh, at the fifth inning, I got to do some color commentary. And uh, then I wanted to stay. Uh huh. And they kicked me out of the booth. Yes. Well. <laughs> It's so much fun to yeah, do, sit around and talk about sports. The I mean. Mets humbled the Cubs this weekend. Yes, you know that, they, right? did. they did. They yeah. really did. Yes. No, well, you know, it's scattered applause. Now, yeah, well, it's scattered in New York about the Mets, I'll tell you. Um, tough so, year, tough and, year. And you're a baseball fan. Absolutely. And, a big, and it's the last week of the season, so yes. it's all coming down. This is, the, this is the time to watch. Yeah, this, this is, is when it's the most this fun. This is really fun. And there's a, lot of, uh, there's a lot of close races, too. Yes, there are. So it's, and the uh, Cubbies just hurt themselves badly. Yeah, but they're still in the oh, game right. up in the, in the okay. wild card. And we're just going to talk about baseball, baseball folks. Okay. Sorry. You want to hear a baseball story? I'll tell you a baseball story about this man right here. Can I do that? Why? This is, this is, this <laughs> for the first time, I, he's a, he's a darn good baseball player. So we were playing in a, in a uh, Dodgers oh, celebrity oh, the Hollywood game. Hollywood star. Yeah, every Base, year. Real baseball, no messing around. Tony's pitching. I figure I'm going to go smack this out of the park with Tony pitching. I go up there. I have a, an aluminum bat. He won't pitch to me. Oh, yeah, I would pitch to him. Because he's going to kill me if he hits the ball with that bat. So he made me get a wood bat, so I got the wood bat. First pitch, I crushed it foul. And by the way, one. I'm talking far. <laughs> I was like this. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh, God. I'm thinking, uh oh. But then the second pitch, a little slider. I missed it. I was like, okay, wait a minute. 0 oh, 2, I'm in trouble. So I'm stepping in the box, getting ready for the next pitch. Tony, quick pitch me. Oh, <laughs> quick pitch me. A little early, slider, <laughs> strike three. Yay. I'm out. He owns me. Yeah, no, he owns me. Well, I will say, <laughs> I, I don't know if I own you, but there was something about striking out Superman that felt really good, I gotta tell you. I really good. <laughs> now, now, Dean, I don't think a lot of people know this. You, you really were, uh, I mean, you went, first of all, you were an All-American at Princeton University. I mean, in football. Football, football, man. I learned it. First of all, what kind of grades you need to get into Princeton? Really good ones. Yeah, because I couldn't uh, even, they wouldn't let me drive past. <laughs> well, it really helped, you know, having extracurricular activities and being a, being a ball player. Well, I, was, I was a highly recruited ball player, so, so that really helped. And in fact, you uh, have a record. Oh, you had the uh, interception record for a year, the NCAA. The NCAA record, yeah. I had yeah. it for 13 years, and then a kid broke it two years ago. Um, he's a starting cornerback for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Yeah, Jaguar I got a picture now. of you here in, in, in oh, action. Yeah. Here we are in action. Is look that the way? Yeah, look at that, huh? Tough guy right there. So, what's your greatest sports moment, I mean, from college? You know, honestly, uh, my, because I played at Princeton, I'm from California. I'm actually, we actually live near each other in California. When, you know, well, we see each other most yeah. much, sure. But uh, uh, my, my parents wouldn't, they didn't get to see the games. They're not nationally televised that often. And so um, they didn't see any games throughout my whole career until my senior year. They saw, you know, they see one or two a year. Uh -huh. My senior year, my parents, they moved to Princeton for the entire semester of my, the uh -huh. first semester of my senior year. And they went to every single ball game. Oh, We'd cool. pull to North Carolina. And there'd be like one car in the, in the parking lot, and my buddy taps me, hey, my parents. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so it was great. And then uh, I broke the NCAA record for interceptions in a single season. And they were there. And they were there. Oh, and I, I caught the ball, and I, I got knocked out of bounds on my own sideline. And I went over to my dad, who was in the stands, and I threw him the ball. Ah. And he caught the ball and was very proud, and he threw it back to me. And I like, threw it back, and I'm like, you keep that. I just, <laughs> I, I got it. But that, that was my greatest sport. I love that moment. Keep it! I'm throwing it to you, for guys. So, so um, and you got a four-year-old, am I right? I have a four-year and three-year, uh, four years and three months old little boy. Christopher. Christopher. He is, man. I mean, I know you're a father. It, it, it's just 
It's the best thing I've ever done, and he's the best part of my life. Yeah, he, 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 it's amazing. And what a great age, too, four years old. My gosh. I get a lot of love. A lot of love. A lot of love. Yeah. And it goes like that. It stays that way, and you get love. Even, even when they turn 17, they don't talk too much, but they still love you. <laughs> It's just like one, uh, what did I give you, one, uh, one syllable you got. That's you know? it. Yeah, I, I, I'm just so in love with my kid, I can't, I can't even stand it. And he's, uh, he's hooked on uh, this group. I haven't seen this group. Uh, I've heard about it, though. My staff is all crazy about the group, the Wiggles. The Wiggles. What is the, Have you, guys you know seen what the, the Wiggles? Wiggles? You know what they are? There's people going, oh, yeah, I know what the Wiggles are. What are the Wiggles? The Wiggles are these four Australian guys who dress in primary colors and sing these silly songs. <laughs> Literally, I, I kind of didn't want my kid to watch it. I'm like, all right, you know, I flip by and he's like, Daddy, Daddy, that. I'm like, you want to watch the, those guys? He's like, yeah. I watch it. Next thing you know, I'm singing the songs. It's like, <laughs> we're doing like, the songs are like, uh, my God, the songs are so, you're a better singer than I for sure. But they sing about like, um, what was, which one was that? The big red car, and they're driving their big red car. Mm. I was thinking about the fruit salad. Fruit salad. Fruit salad. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Fruit salad. I mean, these little songs. It's just... Sounds great. Yeah, it's, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Next thing you know, I'm thinking, smash banana, mash so banana. I'm doing we... that. Like, what am I doing? You got to tell. Tell me a little bit about the show and about working with Chris Lloyd, my pal. Yes. Well, Clubhouse is, I mean, I love sports. I've always loved sports. I always consider myself an athlete first. And Clubhouse, I play, I play basically the greatest baseball player in the game today. Um, what Jared, Derek Jeter will be in like six years because right. my character is a little bit older than him. But uh, it's, it's a fictional team, the, the New York Empires, and the story is really told about uh, through the eyes of the 16-year-old Bat Boy. Right. I was, saw the show. I loved it. I, like I it? really uh, enjoyed it. No, I really enjoyed it. It's got this magical feel to it, which yeah. is so wonderful. And I love Mayor Winningham, too. She's a great actress. She's a great actress. We yeah. have really, really strong cast, and of course it starts with the big boy, Christopher Lloyd, Christopher. and he is, he is so much fun to work with. I mean, I don't have to tell I you that. I love that scene just there where he okay. says, you know, you, the, the, you missed the best part, giving you, give you your knowledge to pass it along. I mean, it's, just a, it's so great. Yeah, it really is a terrific show. Uh, please watch it. Yeah, please watch it because uh, we're all on the, yeah. Christopher Lloyd, can I tell you a funny Chris? I mean, please. Yeah, I'm sure you've got 9,000 of them, but the first, when you first meet his character, which was uh, in the pilot episode, he decided to pick a prop, which would be a five-gallon you know, five right. jug of water. And he had to do it like 35 times. Yeah, yeah. Spark and threw it over his shoulder. He's in great shape, yeah, he's by the boy. way. Big, Oof. strong kid. And he threw it over his shoulder. And, you know, after like take seven, he's like, why would I pick that stupid prop? You know? <laughs> it's like, it's pretty yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> all right. I know better than that. So, since uh, we both uh, like to play baseball, and uh, we, we decided to put uh, a little bit of a, a contest together and, 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 and help see if maybe we can win something for the audience. So we're going to meet one of New York's finest pitchers, put us to the test when we play Sidewalk Strikeout. We'll be back with Dean Kane. Uh, here's the game. See, we play in the rain here with the Tony Danza Show. If we, we got this course set up, if we hit the ball over the first, the first marker, the blue marker, you get a hat, the audience. If you hit over the second marker, you get a t-shirt and a hat. The third marker, we got a deal on these, uh, on these tooth toothbrushes. Sonicare toothbrushes by Phillips. There you go. All right, so that's for the long ball, okay? By the way, how about the weather here? Okay. Oh, this is John Cirillo, our pitcher from the Van Ness Little League. He's 12 years old, and he's an all-star. Get out there, Johnny. Get over there and strike out deep. You're cute, but I'm taking the yard, Go man. first. You first. Where, where's the plate? Where's the plate? Uh, where's the plate? Right there. Right there. Here's the plate. That's the there plate. it is. Okay. okay. I got to do my, I gotta I'll do catch. my thing, I'll man. catch. Hang on to that bat for me. I got you there, baby. I got you. Oh! Oh! It's a oh! Pack. What happened to the back oh! If the bat goes, does that count? Oh, come on, dude. Oh, this is trouble. Get him, Johnny. Oh, popped him up. Popped him up. Popped him up. Right, him up. Right. There we go. Get it now. A little tougher in the rain. Oh, Whoa, that's two. That's a, that's a, uh, a hat and a T-shirt. I, I, uh, Mike, watch sure. it. Don't let that thing fly out of your hands. Be careful. Right. Oh, Ooh, that's a T-shirt. I got to get one more. Come on, come on. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Give me another bat. It's raining. Thank God I'm not the only one who did it. Yeah. Oh. You know what, folks? Oh, one more, one more, right, one more. One more, and then you go one more, Dino. All right. Oh. That would be a toothbrush. That's it. That's gone. That's your toothbrush. That's out of here, man. That's gone. And that's it. All right. Hey, John. That's a double. We got you. We got you your favorite guy's Yankee thing. Thank you very much for being here, okay? A-Rod, Dino. Thank you. Thank you. In the rain, in New York.
Thanks very much. We'll be right back. You know, great. <laughs>